On today's episode, we're going to take five intentions of growth. We're going to teach you how to take a thought, repeat it until it becomes a habit, then treat that habit as a living experience to get the full benefit. I hope you're ready for this. Next to me, Anna Mary Meyer and Eddie Mahane. Sure. Thank, Thank you. you. Let's Thank give you. these people some value. <laughs> Number one, let go of what no longer serves you. Even if it's people, bad habits. Yeah. Um, I don't want to say colleagues, but, but cut away from people. That's gonna even colleagues. Even colleagues. Yeah. Especially cut family. Family, definitely. Cut away from people that drain you. Rather just fill your life with things that make you happy. Because the moment... Discipline. It's a lot of discipline, yeah. but you have to do it. It's that old saying of you don't always have to say yes. You can say no, mm -hmm. but you need to let go. Because okay. the moment you do that, you're going to start growing. Yeah. Absolutely. Number two, celebrate your wins. Yeah. So every win is one step forward. Yeah. Now, no matter if, how big or small. Yep. Yeah. So if you don't recognize it, you might not find enough reason to win again tomorrow. But you've got so to recognize no matter, it. Yes. No matter how small the win is, you need to celebrate it. That will motivate you to want to, mean, to win more. So yeah, you have to always, always, always celebrate those wins. 100%. Number three, listen to your gut and ask yourself, what would the wisest version of myself do in this situation and do that? Mm -hmm. Now, I've um, worked with a high-performance coach that taught me to... Um, reflect as three things that I want to be, and that's a leader, enabler, and kind in a situation. But kind doesn't mean weak. So for many, many years, I thought kind means weak, and kind means, you know, you always have to be a pushover. And kind yeah, is very kind strong. Is yeah. Kind is very strong. So leader, enabler, and kind in a situation, um, you know, take some time off and say, okay, the wisest version, the leader, enabler, and kind, what would he do? Think about it. You know, give it some time, think about it again, and go with that decision. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, True. you'll never reach that person that you're trying to become. Yeah. Number four, focus on progress. If you don't, you need to set goals, first of all. And focus on the progress. Yes. You, no matter and you how small. Need to, no matter how small. And for me, we've had this discussion a couple of times. For me, I need to take something out of my day. Because every day I'm living my best day. Absolutely. But because there's something. Because the moment you say I'm stuck in a rut, I don't want to be here, uh, you won't see the progress. But the moment you turn around and say, I need to live my best day today, yeah. you're going to start seeing the progress and you want to do more. 100%. Lastly, if you make a mistake, seek to understand. Yeah. yeah so so I, I always say this. I always um, tell the guys in the team that, listen, it's either, it's either that the mistake we made today will cost us money today, um, but it's an opportunity to learn. From this mistake, all we can be is the better version of ourselves tomorrow. Absolutely. This is a, a, a mistake that we need to document so that we can always come back and have a look and say, on a day like this and this, we took a wrong step here and this is what happened. You've so, got to admit that mistake. Yeah. Yeah. You have to own it. Yeah. For so long as you learn from them, then they're worth having. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. You can lose, but don't lose the lesson. Mm -mm. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If it added value, please hit the like button as well and as... please subscribe to our channel. <laughs> Remember to ring the bell. Thank and you very much. Yes. Sure. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Take care and bye-bye.